can stream. I was a little late today. Sorry for that. Two minutes late. I was too busy watching Filza. So the original thing I was going to do, I had to put aside. Because I don't have the time to get it ready. But that's okay. I can save that for another time. So today we're just going to do some straight up MCFN. See what works, what doesn't work, how it is. You know, it's typical. And someone's playing the stream really loud right next door. Hmm. Anyways. What should we play? We'll, we'll see if anything's new in the hive. Because it's been a while since I've been on there. So I'll see if anything's new. They changed some of this stuff. Let's see if there's any new game modes. We got survival games, murder mystery, treasure wars, survival, sky wars kits, sky wars just built. No, so nothing, no new game modes. Is there any new game modes within the game modes? Mm, doesn't seem like it. Let's get always just solos. I think it was. Mega was edited a while ago. That no, that will just send me right in, and that will send me right in. So they added nothing new. Maybe a couple skin changes or ads, but that's just about it. Uh, I don't know what to do now. I. So is there any like quest? What is that? What is it? Aiden's inviting me to a party. Uh, let me get the stream started off first. I'll invite him to a party. Invite players. Invite all on the line. Friends. Okay. Now oh, I'm going to send him a Zoom invite. So I'm going to try multitasking by speaking. But also getting the Zoom set up. Sending it to him. I know I've got to use two sides of my brains. My brain. See, I'm already messing up on words. I usually mess up on words, but you're going to get a lot more while I'm trying to focus on this. Uh, okay. That's good. I'm talking to myself right now. I'm explaining what I'm doing on the Zoom, but you can't see that. Okay. Sorry. I'm, fo I'm focusing, memorizing, and speaking at the same time. Oh, that's new on Zoom, not in the hive. Okay. Multitasking. Oh, that's wired. I don't like that. Can I close that? Can I, can I close? Why can't I close that? That's annoying. Okay, sorry. You can't see what's going on. 7788. Don't say those out loud. Sorry if I'm, man. So I'm going to be quiet for a bit because I have to memorize numbers. Speaking is not a good way to memorize things. <laughs> See, I already got something wrong. Luckily, I caught myself now. Get in this out of the way. Oh my gosh. And so many things wrong. Multitasking. It's hard. That's when you're. Messenger isn't working. Okay. Okay. Almost done. I know it's been quiet for a bit, but I'm almost done. I thought there was something pop up. Hang on. Hope it's correct. So I sent it. Hopefully it's correct. I didn't get anything wrong. Okay, so. 
what I feel like doing. No, I'm not gonna limit myself to a quest. And Aiden left my party. Alright. He's probably trying to join the Zoom. So I'll leave the hive. There's nothing new on there. Nothing entertaining. I've done it all, seen it all. Let's go to Cubecraft. I like Cubecraft. There's a lot to do on the Cubecraft. The Cubecraft is at least... I mean, not, not extremely fast, but the Cubecraft likes to expand, which I like. They're consistently adding new things. Not like they're adding a bunch of things, but at least there's something changing in the world around you. Like, it, it very rarely you'll be able to predict what's around you. Like, this has been like this for a while now, but, you know, if you go back to earlier streams, this main area didn't look like this. It was different, and then just like a couple months ago, it was like China themed. Oh, hey, Aiden's here. That's a little loud, but I think it'll be fine. I can turn it down. I had it right up on my mouth. Is it better now? Oh yeah, yeah, it's it's better now. I was like, I was thinking that. I was like, you sound different. I'm on the cube craft. You know when you did the stream and you checked out the Skylight and you saw the lapis generators? Huh? Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Skyblock. I didn't buy those. Those were there. There's generators hidden throughout. Oh. Okay. Like the islands, and I scrapped those. So I was like, that that's a little suspicious. But it still was like two hours. Okay. Uh, let's see. Do some minor work because the thing with Cubecraft, they they never like fully announce when there's a change to minorware. So you could like minorware is one of those things where you could go a while without playing it, and then there could be some new game modes. But you could also go like a really long time without playing, it and there'll be nothing. So, are you in Cubecraft? Yeah. Okay. I don't know why I was trying to get his name up, he's not here today. Yeah, Kanan's not here today. He said something about Chicago. Yeah, no, it's so bad. I know, bad Chicago. Person. Can't even imagine being in Chicago. Anyways. Bro, you like my custom skin? Uh, pens. Oh, that, uh, it's not... I feel like I've seen it somewhere. The face. The face, person. yeah. There's that one guy who does the, the Minecraft escape rooms. Not escape yeah, I rooms. I, I made it. Alright. Minor work. Okay. Yeah, you can actually play this game mode now that you're not on mobile. sound stuffy it's because you live in the cold place no it's because every spray when it starts to warm up I get this every, every it takes four days every time <laughs> yeah there's someone with cadence skin which the same person okay symbol I gotta memorize these I think I know what this one is it's jump in the hole with the beacons. Where's the beacons? There's the beacons. There we go. Already doing a fantastic job. Less is better. Ooh. They're playing the line, they're playing the line. Let's go. Oh. Oh, that guy just ran at me and hit me. He's how they get such a wombo combo hit. Every yeah. Time they go back like a block and then they hit me and I have to remember because usually when I play this game, I can put a lot of blame on Caden because he's a little target boy. 
he he get he gets bored. So you know what he does? He says, you know that dizzy lizzy guy, kind of a huge threat to my game right now. So I'm just going to target him, even if that means my game gets absolutely ruined. Haha. <laughs> Let's go. <sighs> then I escape. Fairly simple. Like it even tells you when the ice is about to break. Easy. Easy money. Oh, this one's broken. It's not this time. Where is it? I missed it. No. I saw gold and I saw helmets. I did not see a golden helmet. Okay. Whew. Doing good. In the lead. In the lead. Died with tied with that guy. Swim to platform. Oh, this one's broken. Oh, man. Yeah, I yeah. Oh, oh it's, not it's pretty much just get lucky. Oh my gosh. Stop pulling the Caden. Okay. No, I was blocking off at the last Okay. <sighs> did it, did it. This is Jaquavian guy. I was, I was I was so focused on crouching there that I, <laughs> I, I stopped breathing. I know, but I was so focused. I don't know why. It said sneaking, and then it said just sneak, and I just forgot. To, oh, this one's weird. Oh, what the heck? Just, just run to the middle and click. That's what I've learned. I just keep bitten bombs out. Yeah, I have no clue how this oh. works. Let's go. <laughs> and then type for circle. Okay, I'll miss yeah. this. We're on, because sometimes they reset. Alright, we're good. Arson. Okay. Ooh. Oh, this is a fun one. If it's the one I think it is. Yeah, but if you die, you get sent back to the top. I died. Oh. Easy. I lost. Okay. I'm usually good at that one. I couldn't find my rhythm that time. Oh. Hot potato. Basically tag. Ha! He missed! Oh, this one is. This one's basically hope you find the right. Oh, I did it. What do you have to do? Just don't get hit by TNT. TNT fell, and if you're next to it and die, you lose. This one's free. Apparently not. There we go. Pretty easy. Pretty easy. You get you have plenty of time to do that. Okay, oh, I'm pretty good at this one. I hate this one. Oh, I'm in a block. I'm not in a block. There's no animals around me. Let's go. Oh, freak out. Don't get no. You you. Get back here. Okay, I got him. Good. I'm very low on the cow to count. Haha. <laughs> I rhymed. No. I didn't. Ship. Dude, none of them were spawned. Yeah, I'm not doing good this time. I heard. 
Huh? What language? What language? With me, this is the battle of the sheep. Oh, I lost it. Yeah, I'm not winning this. This guy is stealing my animals. It's kind of the whole point of the game. No, but he's like literally. I'm about to get him, and he's like, "No, mine." And we sit here for like minutes trying to steal one sheep for one point while everyone around us is like getting rich. It's not fair. What do you have? I have three! Oh, because he just steals them from me! Five for first, let's go. <sighs> okay. Let's do it again. I'll save it for another stream. Actually, there was two things I wanted to do, and I was I was kind of undecided before coming into the stream, what I was gonna do, but then I got busy watching Philza VR Minecraft, and I was like, oh, it's eight o'clock. I'm supposed to have this everything ready by now, so I had to rush and get Minecraft open and get the title in, and I forgot to make it high quality stream. So now it's just mediocre. What is this? Oh! I didn't read the name. I just I just saw a bunch of... I know you... I don't know if that was done on purpose or not, but I need an excuse of garbage. Okay. Yeah, if this one block blows me for- oh, okay, whew. Chill out, Oh, uh, let's just- I'm gonna tell you something. I'm gonna give you a little hint to hint. Uh, what are you streaming next? Next week? Yeah. I don't know. The- Kaden has talked to me about some thing that I'm not supposed to know about that was supposed to happen this week, but because he's in Chicago, it won't happen. I'm not yeah. supposed to know yeah. about it. So we could do that next week if Caden's available. Alright, cool. Let's just say, I think you'll like it. As long as you agree to the, uh... I want to say terms, because that's stupid, but... Like the agreement. Hmm. It's pretty cool, I think you'll like it. It'll be entertaining. Please, that I ignited that. I ignited that, please. I ignited that last one. That wasn't that other guy. It was me. It was me. I swear, if it says you lost, if it says you lost, I will be mad. Oh mm, my gosh! A little competitive today. We were being competitive in science, not science, Spanish. The other S class. Oh. Oh. Ooh. Ooh. Just run. Just run. I'm dead. Yeah, I realize is that this game mode, I get kind of competitive. And I don't talk. Because... I'm kind of competitive. What's this? Oh, Drop to the ground. Okay. Oh, I'm falling. How am I at half a heart? Please don't kill me. Okay. Whew. Oh, made it. <laughs> I was on half a heart and had to make a tricky decision on the fall. Okay. So 
What are you doing? You're not accomplishing anything, guys. Oh, no, I'm shooting. Oh, no, I have no I... No, there was three seconds left! The ore. Where's the ore? Got it. It's gold. It's gold. Where's the gold? There's no gold. Why is there no gold? Please, gold. I. There's. <gasps> I'm gonna mute for a second. Oh, of course it locked me out of Minecraft. Sometimes I hate. Soup. Give me a minute. Cook some crust. Okay, pork. Gotta get pork. Pork. Let's go. Okay. First. Where's cook? Let's go. Yeah. Okay. So I'm going to try explaining the story, but I'm in competitive mode. So if I stop mid story and a couple details are off, please don't be mad at me. Anyways, today in Spanish class, we were doing this like weird competitive, uh, like volleyball thing. Okay. So our class got split into two groups. Okay. And w one you serve, like in volleyball you have to an answer like a question and the question is usually like how do you say city block in spanish you know uh and can you eat cobwebs no okay um you answer a question if you get it correct then you get to serve it's like normal volleyball and i got real competitive because if you didn't know the answer you could ask other people in your group you know then they could help you and so whenever there was someone on the other team who didn't have the answer you know what I would do I would yell random Spanish words out loud so that they would get confused I know big brain technique so I did this and it worked on a lot of people because it Yelling will disrupt their thinking, but it, but if you yell Spanish words, you're already thinking the same language, so you can mess up some pronunciation. And it worked, because I'm a genius. I lost! No! Uh, yeah, anyways, I'm a genius. Moral of the story. Also, there's a video I, that's being edited in the editing process right now. Don't want to give too much information on it. But it's a TV show that I'm obs kind of obsessed with right now. Not going to lie. Really like this show. That's all I'm going to say. I hate you. Um, that's all I'm going to say about it. But I think this is going to be a really good video. Like, I'm really excited for this video to come out. I'm putting so much time. And it looks so good. Like, uh, there's a couple parts... Which, well, once the video is released, you'll know what I mean, but there's a couple parts in the video that are kind of like, uh, that's a little weird, like, you could have done that better. But, like, just realize that the editing for this is taking so long, but it's going to be so good. And I hope this takes off, because this, I don't think anyone's ever done this before, or at least to this extent. That was dumb by me. I'm just like, mm, I'm gonna walk backwards. Okay. Anyways, save and quit. Oh, okay, I'm back. Alright. But anyways, out of the game, but... get prepared on the JK Productions channel. That video that's coming out soon. Hopefully this weekend, maybe next weekend, depending on how some of the editing goes, will be really good. That's all I can say. It's going to be a really good video. Like I've never been so proud in a video before. And my IQ order the Desperados won an award for being the best video. I'm going to assume I shouldn't join the world called the game yet. Uh, I'm going to give you a little bit of a preview. Nah, nah, nah. Full nah, surprise. Give you a bit of Full surprise next week. Let's go back onto Cubecraft. Anyways. Yeah, be prepared on the J Productions channel. That video. I just had to kick this guy. It's going to be really good. I have a good. I... You won't be able to tell anything based on what you said. That's all right. Full surprise for audience and no, for no, me. No, yeah, no, yeah. No, because if you have that surprise factor, view go up. Okay. Yeah. I've been, you're, I've been, you're, no. I've been studying the YouTube analytics. Okay. I've been stu studying. Okay. All right, Researching. 
okay? Staying up for hours, that's a lie. Researching. Destroy it. You literally will not have any idea what it is. I, I have been researching for thumbnails and titles and video ideas, and I have so many ready to go. Hello, the future president. I would bet you a hundred dollars that you couldn't guess what it is. Still, surprise equal view. Join it? No. Instead, if you want to do it, you gotta join it. That's, that's how it works. Fine. I join. But just know, voice crack, oh, sorry for that. Just know, I'm being peer pressured. You won't be able to tell me. Okay. Bongoos. Yeah, we're just doing a normal stream today. I had two other things I was going to do, but I was a little late to start in the stream. So I just did a normal M Minecraft fun night. Is this... The left looks familiar. Is it? No. Maybe? No. Definitely not. So you yes. can't tell her. Hmm. I'm not going to say what I think it is, because if it is what I think it is, I'm going to be... Why does... He sound different? Uh, Aiden has a new mic. Um... And I'm sick. Oh yeah, he's a little stuffy because he lives in the cold place. Um, I'll let you guess. I won't say if it's correct. Or no, I'm not going to guess because my if my guess is correct, I'll not only be mad, but also if my guess is correct, then it, or if my guess is not correct, then they'll be. Ooh. Here, I'll make this promise to you. No matter what your guess is, I'll save me. No, even that, it, it, it's one of those things we is what my guess is, is something that I already have planned. So I don't want to say it. And then... Let's just say, I think you're going to like this. Then we're going to, maybe it's, okay. I'm intrigued. I live in his basement. Oh. You hear that, Aiden? I don't know. Someone's living in your basement. How do you feel about that? Uh, I don't know. Oh, I'm a, hold on, I have to see this. It's been so long since I've been on. Oh, what are we going to do? What are we going to do? I don't know. Servers are getting old. Honestly, Minecraft in general is starting to get old to me. Oh, my goodness. It's you know nations. Get old? You know doesn't get old? What? I don't have any stick. <laughs> Sorry, I was something in my throat. I don't have stairs. So. You don't remember the hole in your stairs? Oh, that's so sad. Oh my gosh, the hole in my stairs! Your video quality is way better than it used to be. Oh, thank you. I think it is because I got it the new editor. Because the last golf stream, people were saying that as well. But I didn't know if it. Was because because we recently got a like replaced our older router with a newer one or something like that. We did something along those lines, and so that might have affected the video quality because our router was very, it wasn't the best and it was kind of a little in and out. Like sometimes you get good internet and then sometimes you know, everything just shuts down for a quick second. So it is better now, and that might be affecting the stream as well. Last stream, I actually changed it so that the video quality was high, automatically higher. So that I thought that would change it, but if you're saying it's good here, that I didn't, I forgot to change it this time. So basically, internet, internet better, internet better, quality better. There you go. What are you gonna do? I'm thinking some city pro. City pro? Sure, I've been doing a little. Okay, I'm gonna make a copy of the world first. So I was not expecting to play it this stream because I was expecting to do something else. So I'll make a copy of the world first. But 
Anyways. Wow, you made a copy. Just in case anything happens, like someone joins and ends up oh. destroying everything, we at least have a backup copy. Fair enough. I'll delete the old backup copy. Then no matter what, even if somehow like the copy of the world gets destroyed, or the, the, the main world gets destroyed and the backup copy gets destroyed, we still have the preserved world, which is the world you're not allowed on. So I always make sure before I go on City Pro there is a copy of the world of the time before I go on. So if anything happens, all that's getting destroyed is my time on that world. Not the time beforehand. So at least the damage is... I'm, I try to make any damage in case someone tries to join and ruin things as minimal as possible. Then I... That luckily hasn't happened yet, but as you can see, I've been doing some changes to the world. Oh, I'm intrigued. So I'll invite Aiden. Egg sandwiches online. That's a big streamer there. Bigger than I am. There we go. <laughs> anyway, so yeah, we have... Just to go over to people watching in the future, anyone watching now who doesn't know the rules of City Pro or what City Pro is, I'm going to go over some things. So, I'm going to... Well, not go over some things. I'm going to explain what the world is. So, Hello. Welcome to City Pro. As you can see, you are in creative mode. Go out and make a cool building for the city. It does not have to be a good build. Just look at Town Hall. Turn around for the rules. That's the community trash. Rules. Rule number one. No griefing. We'll end up getting banned. Rule number two, no saying bad things about other builds. Rule number three, all build needs must be connected to a road. You can build a road though. Rule number four, no bad words in chat. Rule number five, before making a redstone machine, ask Mayor Dizzy Lizzy three, Dizzy Lizzy 2000, not 3000, slash Jodel Green. Uh, this rule was added because there were two people on this world, not gonna say any names, but there were two people on this world who were like, ha ha, ha ha, this world, we going to make redstone machine and just make it absolutely annoying. So I had to add this rule. Then the next rule is rule number six, Mayor is the only one who can destroy other builds. This is because there is one person on this world, not gonna say any names, who added a bunch of redstone to the world and then made it absolutely annoying. So I added the fifth rule, but then they didn't get rid of the other stuff because I said it would be griefing. So I added this world so I could destroy the stuff that they made purposely to ruin the world. Stoop the grief. Okay, so I'm gonna do a little show off to the world. I don't know what this is, but just showing the different builds to anyone who hasn't seen before. What is this voice? I don't know. I just felt like doing whatever. So this is the Five Nights at Freddy's cafeteria. Very nice. Worked hard on it. Probably one of my best ever builds in Minecraft, in my opinion. And there's a couple things I could have done better. Oh, there's this added the rainbow thing. On your kitchen yeah, I'm about to build something out of order I forgot what this looked like I've actually seen the game since then and I realized that there's not really much I could have done to change here Minecraft wise oh, okay. closet security room I could have made this look better but I really wanted to add this because it's part of the game. So that's that. So you go over here. It's a nice little front. Parking lot. First, sing the FNAF beatbox. I can't do that. Uh, this is the first ever car in City Pro made by I forgot his name. School bus to the, to the school that doesn't exist. I'll add that after I'm done building the road that Aiden didn't build. And then I finish the mansion, which I have to wait for Aiden to fix the hole in my stairs. 
I'm pretty sure it's fixed. But... Uh, zombie villagers. This used to be a villager hut, but now, you know, the designer didn't think of every possibility, which is okay. Oh, yeah, there's no hole. I don't know why. Lore's up there. You can look at different... I would go up there. I'll save that for last because there's some other things I want to show off. What Caden claims to be a house... Uh, the shrine for shrine for the blood god. The pigs are gone. I have to refill that. Anyways, I've been working on this forest, and I think oh I forgot the bone meal some parts though, so I'll have to go through and do that. So I'm not fully done. So you can oh, go and see. So walk here. You keep going straight. You can turn left to the football field where there's a pig in there apparently now. You can go straight on the walking path or right to the walking path around the, the lake. Slash to the mansion. So you go here, keep going straight. Ooh. No. Beach time. But, it, you know, it's a lake, so you know the sand isn't as good as it is in the ocean. Florida flex. Um, yeah, but we got mud. We have... What? So you walk around. If you take a left here, you go to the mansion, which isn't done yet. I'm going to add... I think the trees might be added that no that the trees aren't fully added over there. I still have to add them over here. Oh the bear. The mansion bed. Living room. Door to the outdoors. Not more. No. Look around. Container. I think that's supposed to be the fridge. Aiden did some stuff. The hole in my wall. I mean, hole in my stairs. This, which is weird to get into. Don't know what this is. There's just a hole that leads to nothing in here. My closet's gone, Aiden. Um, yeah, apparently, you know, you walk in. Oh, there's trap doors. Don't know why. You flip these two ones up, and you gotta do some weird mechanicalness. Really just did it. And you see, it doesn't, it doesn't work. See, now there's a hole to the stairs. But guess what? You're outside now. See, now I'm locked out. I can't get inside because somebody removed the back door. So now I'm just trapped outside. And I'm going well, to cry. And right. I'm cold. All right. All right, I'm going to ask you. Do you want me to work on this? No, this I want, don't house. want this. Anyways, it's the upstairs. Carpet. Ooh. So I made these epic chandeliers while someone else could not be on my video. Bedroom. Very open. Should add some stuff in there. Other bedroom. A spacious bedroom. A small bedroom. Nice view there. Nice. Again, so this isn't filled. I'm going to fill that up with trees. Actually, it's better at night because this next part actually looks better at night coming up. So I'm going to run. Yeah, more forest. Blah, blah, blah. Trees. Yes. No, the typical. I would have added some trees there, but I want some city stuff to be there. And I can't trespass here because technically it's Caden's property. Come here, you got the night's lights on the torches. Little path lit up. You know. You just follow them, and it's just kind of bright to the end. I added these because they want to add trees right next to the road because, you know, tree hazard. Don't want that in the main road of your city, you know, because I'm an architectural genius. So, then you just kind of this next part, you just walk through the forest. It's quite lovely. You know, take away you know the whole empty area that's supposed to be filled right there. Uh, 
Okay, hello. It's also kind of like scary at night, in a way. Wait, wait, so here's the first big tree. You walked all this way, you see one big tree. Okay, you walk forward. Big tree, big tree, big tree, big tree, big trees everywhere. And now they're gone. Yeah, and then you just kind of walk. Because I'm going to stay low for this next part. Oh my god, the forest is on fire. No, don't put set the fire out. Well, thanks for ruining my big reveal. Stop! No, stop! What? That's on purpose. Oh. Ah, I was going to reveal that, but now I can't reveal it because it's already been revealed. How's it going to come around? Burn down your whole forest. That well, there, no, you see, I recently put areas between the trees because one fire doesn't spread in this world oh okay uh, i didn't know that okay but also i uh, just in case because i'm a precautious person i left a good amount of space between this and the forest but i, I added this because i thought it'd be weird if i just ended the forest right next to the nether part so i added burning trees because you know i think that's what trees would do if they're right next to a nether like area which nether is lava in it and is burning hot Let's get flint and steel. If this epic comes lunch. Actually, I don't want that. There we go. There we go. Alright, show it out. I'm gonna give you a, I'm gonna give you an option. Would you rather me to expand it some of this world stuff, or have me start my big project in this world? Uh, well, I don't know, cause you have a lot of things in this. You have some things in this world that like are kind of look incomplete. Like you have this big glass dome over here, and that's, that's just it. That's the entrance part. Then you have this beginning of this, what's going to be maybe like a bank or something. I can't fully. Oh yeah, I think it's the bank. You got yeah, this bank, bank getting right. ready to be built. So you got two like things that are unfinished. Yeah, at the same time, I think you might <coughs> like the thing that I'm planning on building. And if you want to start building it, I just want to remind you, you do have some things in this world that are well, like kind of big. Of the bank is just kind of. Okay, if it's an expansion of the glass dome, then yeah, you Dude, can just... Who put beds on my glass dome? I don't know. Trees provide oxygen for it. I go all the way over here to start. This is gonna probably... Oh, wait, I gotta go up the, the rainbow tower. I said I was gonna I'll do that. stay around 10 MC. Is it the pro stream? Can you hear that? Hear what? Okay, I'll take that as a no. <laughs> what I really like though with the football field is because because I decided to light it up, it looks it looks pretty cool from above. Like it looks really cool if you look at it from above, because it has this like not like nice glow to it that makes it stand out from the rest of the city. Which I like. What does? The stadium. Like if you try going up down the rainbow tower, right before you go up at night, it has like this r almost like beautiful glow to it. But I can't determine if it's like beautiful or not because I made it, so obviously I have a little bit of a bias there. But I think it looks really nice at night when you're like about to go down the rainbow tower. So that's all we have so far, but this this is a city to expand. City to grow. Which will be really annoying because, you know, my dreams of this world is to have it expand into, like, you know, amazing builds. And, or, you know, amazing builds, but even that, like, some just, you know, builds that you can tell someone tried. 
just different creativity and people's interpretation of how things would look and how big cities look in their own architectural styles and all of that kind of merged into a big city. But one of the things I don't like is that one of the first things you see is this. <laughs> like, what is this door? It's two enchantment tables with item frames on them of doors. I'm not gonna do any put plant any trees over here. Cause I want to finish the backyard of the house before I put trees around it. Cause I don't want to be limited to whatever wherever I put the boundaries of the trees. And I don't fully know what I want the backyard of this mansion to be like. So I'll wait for Aiden to fix the ginormous hole in my wall before I start doing anything. Because I don't want to do anything. Because I I personally don't want this big hole in the wall here, but. Aiden seems very persistent about it. So I don't want to start okay. making things just to find out something's off. This forest looks nice. I like... I like how it looks. Of course I'll have to put like bone mill around. Because... Over here looks really nice because you have the grass and the flowers. Then over there looks kind of bland because you don't have that. Like over here it's a little weird but I can go out here. And see it already looks better now that there's some grass there. Because there's more to look at. More for your eyes to see. More for your eyes to fathom. More. More. Yeah. <sighs> I don't know. You can only think of so many words until words don't word anymore. Quote that. Can you join? Yeah. If you're online, I can send you an invite, and if you're, you might be able to just join automatically, I don't know. If you hop on online, I'll, I can send you an invite. You'll be able to join, make your own masterpiece. Oh, check her joined. Oh, because you're friends with Aiden, and Aiden's in, and it's friends of friends. Yeah, no problem. You can build whatever. Hang on, so let me find you. Where are you? I'm gonna go along the road until I find you. But you can you can build whatever. You can branch off of one of these roads and have it go in your own direct uh, direction you want to. Or you can con I guess you can't continue because they didn't build these giant structures right outside where all the roads are. So you can't continue off of it, but you can have a road just turn in a direction if you wanted to build that way. And it doesn't have to be the same style as I, I first did it. If you want to make your own road style, you can, or you can just build off of it as long as you give, as long as it's not intersecting with another person's build. So if you like put the center of your build right here, you got to be careful because the, the, left side can only go out to this far because this is something Caden built. The right side can go out as big as you want as long as it's not just purposely big to be big unless it's it, uh, 
if it's big and looks nice, it's fine. But if it's just really big just for the purpose of taking up a lot of space, uh, please don't do that. This is why I added the six rule, just in case, because, you know, you're bound to have people who just place down a bunch of random things. And then no one can build in that space. So, like, if, I, if I'm coming on and I'm like, ooh, this space, I'm going to take it up, blah, blah, blah. Okay, I'm done. Now no one can build here because that's considered griefing. So I can just come through and break these, and now this space is open. The rules on this world are very open right now, just because I hope that whoever joins can respect the fact that, you know, this is someone's build, and I want to, like, build into it. Like, honestly, this right here is quite controversial because I built this to the side and I wanted this to look good so I cut a little bit into this build but because I made this build that's okay so you can cut into your own builds but if this was a situation where someone made this and I was building here I would have to build around it and not cut into it I, I should say that there's should be like a one to just to be nice, just make a, at least like a one block space between your build and someone else's build. Just so there's a little bit of room. At least one block. Preferably some more, but it doesn't have to be super compact. Again, unless it's your own build you're bashing with, then, you know, do whatever you want because both of them are your builds. Does that make sense? I do, I do get that the rules on this world can be a little confusing sometimes just because they're quite vague. Like some rules can be really vague and other ru rules can be really specific. Like a good example is here, like even though I don't really, you know, not the biggest fan of this build because I don't know exactly what it is. I don't think the creator even knows what it is either. But I tried to be as mindful as I could about this part right here. Actually, do I want that? I will be fine. I'll leave that open. I'll actually go through and destroy those very carefully so I don't break any dirt because I don't have any dirt on me. There you go. So I'll just be an open field. realize we're gonna have to do some changes to the not changes to the world but uh, some residential building because right now hey there's not many too, there's not too many places to get a job there's pretty much I guess park ranger could have could be a job because this is a world where not right now but potentially in the future I could definitely see myself uh, like taking the copy of the world and then doing like a I don't know doing like different stuff with the world 
So I could very well, like, if this does really good and people really like it, I could in the future take this world and turn it into a roleplay world. I don't know fully how I would do that and keep it updated. Because if we were to make a roleplay world, I don't know how it would add builds from the main world to the roleplay world. Well, one of the problems is, is I'm on PlayStation, so it's not like I can take this area and copy it and paste it into this world. You know, while no one's looking and that stuff, because there's no files. There's no copy, paste button. No control C, no control V. Pretty much PS, honestly, I'm going to assume console. Minecraft in general, and maybe even mobile, but I, I can't be sure in mobile is very much, maybe maybe not mobile, but very much just like the base game, like can't get mods in world downloads pretty much are non-existent. You can, you can be affected by them if like someone else has them. So I've, if I have a friend who downloads, I think, I, yeah, I think if I have a friend who downloads a mod, and it has that mod in a world, and then I join that world with my friend, then I have access to the mods, but only in that world. And I can only be in that world while my friend's in that world. See, this forest looks, looks so much better with the flowers, because it adds like this new color and life to it. But also, I, I'm stealing this one idea from, oh gosh, what's his name? He's like an Irish streamer. Uh, RT Games. Uh, where I might do the, turn this into like a survival games map. Just add a bunch of, I don't know how I would get it done. I would probably need a lot of help from Aiden, because he's good with that stuff, but find a way to make it. Like, uh, randomized loot and chests and stuff. Because I know he's, Kaden, uh, uh, Kaden's tried to do it. I don't know if Aiden's tried to do it before. But they've tried doing, um, making, what was it, Sky Wars? Custom Sky Wars maps and yeah. game modes. So I'd have to ask them for some help with that. But I'm very, I'm very protective, <laughs> as, as if you've been paying attention to this stream, I've been very, you, you'll find out a common theme is I'm quite protective of the main world. I don't like ideas of people messing with it, even like straight up just making a copy every time I go on, just in case. Because if I, if I were to put making a copy off to the side a bit, all it takes is one person to come through, thinks he's a smart guy, just ruin everything. I'm so like cautious that I like make sure that I make a copy of the world before I delete the old copy of the world because I don't want to because I don't want to accidentally pre delete the original world and then hey let me explain this I don't want to accidentally delete the original world when I had already deleted the copy Does that makes sense like I always make sure in my mind like I'm like like I, I'm trying to find words um, I'll always be thinking I have to I always think I have to copy the world before I delete the world because if I accidentally press delete world del I'm gonna give up because I don't even know what I'm saying anymore I'm sorry I, 
I had a stroke there for a second or something. Brain just kind of stopped processing everything. I'm trying to place the grass and trying to see where it looked good. Because I don't need to place it all over here. Because no one on the path is going to see this. And even when I'm flying above, like, there's so many trees in the way. Like, I, I guess you get a little spots, but it's like, it's that slight difference that I don't think it will matter at all. Because if I'm flying, I'll just be flying. I'm not going to be looking for flowers while flying. While I'm walking. You know, if you're going on a walk, you're looking at the nature around you. You're seeing what's going on in the world around you and all that stuff. So you're looking. You're seeing what's going on. So it's nice to see, you know, those flowers and that vegetation from the ground and the trees and the forest. But when you're flying, you know, you're, you're, you're not running. You're flying for a reason because you, you want to get somewhere fast. Lightning McQueen. Some lightning comes after the thunder. No, wait, no. Before the thunder. That's the line from the movie. Okay. I don't know why today, uh, not today in general, but just right now my brain is, I feel like a computer that's been on for too long, this processing thing doesn't, doesn't work, when I think about something I have to think about it for a while, guess what you're building? I feel like it's going to be, a, it looks kind of like a statue, it's because it's pink. So it might be a statue of something. But it does have kind of building aesthetics, but this could definitely be like legs and it... Something fell over right next to me. Um, it might be Kirby if I had to take a guess. I think it's Kirby. Because I'm trying to think of pink like statues. So I think it's Kirby. But also I have to think that most people would be seeing it. Ah. You know what you should do as a suggestion, what would be cool is if you made it so people could enter through the legs then like climb up to the top and then the glass where you see out of the Among Us where the Among Us is, you, it's like an observation deck so you can like look at the city from a little higher but that also that could dis disrupt how it looks on the outside and then the inside would be kind of compacted or you would have to make it really big so that you have enough room to make the outside look nice and a nice inside, which I know from experience is extremely tedious to do. here because so you can see there's some stuff down here and I have to break this here because um, there used to be trees here but I realized that Caden's building something here and he wants to fill these corners in he does just doesn't know how to do it so I'm gonna give him, I'm gonna give him some space to do that
Okay, the, c the city has some things to be built. Because we need a school. Want to make a residential area. I'm almost done with the park. Just have to wait for someone to fix the hole in my wall. If not, I'll just get rid of it. Because I personally see it as a unnecessary luxury. But that's my personal opinion. And from the review I've heard from other people, is their opinion is the same as well. President, oh, thanks for the uh, compliment. Sometimes I get focused on the game and I don't see what people are typing in chat. Then I'll like see it and I'll be like, should I read this or not? Because I feel like they posted that a while ago. <laughs> so I don't know if I, how delayed the response will be. So I like responding as quick as, as, quick as I can. But as we've seen so far in the stream, my multitasking skills today have not been the best. <laughs> okay. I think after I get all the bone mill in, I just have to finish the mansion and then put in the rest of the trees to fill in those spaces and I'll be done. Kaden hasn't told me what he's building here, so I hope that it doesn't expand out to here. Because I have some stuff built here. But, we'll see. I think, wait no, I have just a little bit more to do, but overall, forest is almost complete. So I'll finish building the road, then I guess I'll start making the school once I'm done with the road. Cause these are all going to be, the, the road is going to be a tedious task, a double T. But it has to be done. It'll make the city look better. Because it already... Adding the road just makes the city look better. Because it just adds a... It, it's almost like they... For the most of this world, it's been like a 2D line. It's been a 2D world. It's been on this line. This turning here, the more I'm like expanding and adding more to it. It's making it seem... Go from 2D. To 3D. Yeah, we're gonna have to get street names as well. Is it comma? Is your 
YouTube username just a comma? Minecraft. What the Oh my gosh, we're at five viewers. I didn't see that. Whoa, hang on. Ooh. Man, we were just at three a second ago. Spaced out there for a second. Wow. I was not prepared for that. We get one more person in here and we break break a streaming record. Wow, jeez, how long has that been like that? Well, welcome. Oh, and we dropped down the three. Wow, I get excited and people leave. What a tragedy. Alright. <laughs> that surprised me. Because we've only had five people watching one other time in the chant during the channel history. That was also a City Pro stream. And oh my god. That that just surprised me so much. I was not expecting that. Wow, that completely changed my mood. I was like kind of tired, not thinking right. And now I'm like, wow, <laughs> we just had five people. And they all left, but you know, the it, comma is... Still here, so oh, we're back up to four. Woo. This is made. Wow, that is, that just made everything about my day feel better. Not like I was having a bad day, but it was like kind of one of those okay days. Not now, it's above the average. Okay. I don't know how I'm gonna make this sidewalk curve around here I'll try my best if you set up donations I might donate I don't know how to do that but I appreciate that you'd be willing to do that but I think there's like a thing on YouTube where I have to I think you have to be monetized in order to be donated money but I'm not sure but I, I appreciate you'd be willing to donate money that thank you like just the thought like the consideration I know we're back up to four and it's been consistent so thank you to the four people watching on this I'm trying to focus because I'm move. Uh -huh. See, my brain isn't working today, or at least right now. So, I'm, oh, that was weird. Uh, so, I might say stupid things, and I don't know if that's a good thing or a bad thing. And we lost person. No. This is best. Yeah, how is this going? Oh, that's looking nice. Good job. Oh, yeah, that's looking good. Hopes it turned. Hope I hopes, I hopes it turns out well for you, mate. Sorry. Ooh. Yeah. Let me see what Aiden's working on because he's been quiet for a bit. So that means he's focused. Beef. Yes. I wonder if the animals will still say even stay even when we put stuff here. Like, will I wonder if animals will still like keep spawning, or if like at least the spawn rate will go down. That's a lot of bed. There's a lot of bed on the roof there. Oh my gosh. This is why Aiden was quiet. This looks. Beef. I don't know why that made me laugh. Oh my gosh, this looks good, Aiden. Nice job. <laughs> I wasn't expecting that because, you know, the the follow-up to that <laughs> was bed. <laughs> Interesting roof choice, but all right. <laughs> I didn't put that there. Yeah, I don't know. It... Still might look better than the roof I made. 
I think the problem is is this is a huge just square. It doesn't ext it doesn't like extend out at certain parts. So when you're, from my experience, I think it's when your your build is just a sort of square, and it's a big square like this one is. It your options are very limited of what you can do. But if I were to do something like make the back come out a bit and make like not like have it the entire thing be pushed to the right but just like a little server uh do you have minecraft bedrock because this is a bedrock server i'm currently playing on playstation if you have bedrock you could send me an invite and i could send you could send me a friend invite via bedrock and then i can invite you to the world but anyways, it, this could come out, and then you can add a different... Okay, so... I don't know if we can get it on this stream, but you could send an invite uh, if you can get on whatever you play on and go to invite a player as friend. Can I'm trying to remember what it is. It's... And then my username... Is not Joe Green, it's Dizzy Lizzy 2000. I think, and I have it in the city hall. So, you, if you send a friend invite, something might pop up on my screen, or at least just come back into chat and tell me when you do so, because then I think we automatically become friends. So, wait, no, not community trash. Uh, it's blocked off there, but it's Dizzy Lizzy 2000. Then once you do that, you should become my friend, and then you can tell me. Or if you're on, no, that wouldn't work because um, brain work hand that wouldn't okay. It wouldn't work because I can't stop the stream. Uh, yeah, just type back in chat once you send an invite to that, and then I could press invite to game. And also put in your username so I know who you are because I have some friends online right now. So I can differentiate you between other people. Yeah. I, I like I like it when people want to join this world because my vision of this world, see, I, I am I, I see things better than they not better, but uh what's the word? I like to envision things in their best form. So when I first was planning on make this world, I wanted to actually wait to create this world because I wanted this pillager guys get out of here. I wanted it to wait until it, it, I have the bad omen. Oh no! Um, oh, that actually might be bad. I could summon a raid. Anyways, I'm getting distracted. I wanted it to be like wait until I got bigger. If I were to get bigger. And then have, I don't know how I would do this because the maximum players for a world is 8. So it wouldn't fully work. But I wanted it to be like a bunch of people. Like I would just make sit, uh, town hall. And then everything would, would be, it would expand. And it would be a bunch of, like, a bunch of people building stuff. And one of my inspirations for this world was um, RT Games actually. He did something very similar to this, and I just am kind of building off of it, but doing it in my own way. In a way that it is in one video, and it's just continue going, What? Did something go wrong? Oh, no. Uh, you could try sending me your, uh, Microsoft, what, what is it? It's the username. Hey, my battery's at 15%. Send me the um, your username, and I can try sending you an invite. That might work. So good. I don't know. Oh yeah, road. That's what I was doing. That's right. Before I went on a tangent, I was building road. consistent for people I remember when like four people I got four people and I was like oh my gosh there's four people 
and then they would leave like you know in an instant now i get to continuously four people i'm just like i just want to say to the four people watching thank you like you were making me feel very good because recently my numbers have dropped because there's a big crave at school when they found not a crave but poll at school when people found out my YouTube name or I was on YouTube so a lot of people started watching videos and I did a Q order to this Pratas, which won an award for being the best out of all my Spanish teachers classes I had the best that was the best person who had made the video and I gained like 10 weeks of an A basically so 10 weeks of work by getting first place and so a lot of people watched that video mainly from the school and then because a lot of people were watching the channel my subscribers were growing up a lot of people were uh, getting recommended my videos so my impressions were up and I was feeling really good about myself and then a month went by and so those numbers started to drop because YouTube takes the numbers of the past 28 days so once 28 days goes goes by and that video starts to drop off like those first incoming viewers drops off you know the numbers severely drop for what your channel is and especially last week I didn't upload because I had family over from across the country so I didn't want to be like nope I'm gonna stop and leave so I didn't stream so those numbers severely dropped but I, I'm getting excited because I have a lot of plans for the upcoming plans for the channel which I think will be nice I think you guys will like them also I'm editing a video right now I said this earlier in the stream but I'm editing a video right now of um I can't I don't want to say too much about it because to my knowledge no one has done this before but it is going to be a really good video and it's probably the best video I've ever done because there's some parts of the video that look so good and so clean I think it'll be nice and it's it's one of those videos where if it does well we can <laughs> we can do this many other times like there there are many different ways in every single voice crack uh, every time we do it it's going to be at least kind of different which is nice I also like it because little hint to the four of you watching because I'm feeling nice um, not feeling nice that made it sound rude uh, so see I know uh, is there something wrong because I'm hearing a lot of abuse hey miglus so gus gus mogu amugu <sighs> yeah, I could really use that command right now as well, but a wise man once said <coughs> It's about drive, it's about power, we stay hungry, we devour, put in the work, put in put in the work, put in the hour and take what's ours. Yeah, I'm not the grindy part yet. Hey, we're dropping in viewers, oh no. Is the content not appealing to you? Sorry, it doesn't have to be. If you don't like it, then, eh. Not your cup of tea. I'm in a very... I've been, I've been speaking a lot more British recently. I'm going to say this entire segment as much as I can in the British accent. Because it's about speaking British. And I've been speaking a lot British recently. I'm going to stop building because I can't speak British, talk, and build at the same time. But I've been speaking a lot of this accent recently because I, um, for two reasons. Actually, one, we're doing Romeo and Juliet in school, which is a play written by a British man. British man from old times. In old times, it's old English. Uh, but also I used a British movie to help pass a test in school I was taking a test in culinary and we 
we're learning uh, about the different ways to oh come to your builder we were learning about the different ways to the, how you the fancy way to i'm gonna stop the first accent because i don't have the brain capacity to do that right now anyways we were in culinary class and we were learning about like how to properly eat like in a fancy way like super fancy way like king and queen dining way and we didn't i don't remember taking any oh this looks nice that's like that's like nice and cozy yeah almost uh, i like your interpretation of i was seeing it as like an observation deck of like you went up and saw it i like you you had the vision of like it's like almost a home like that looks almost like that looks kind of cozy like almost like you want to get snuggled up in there and like you know like it seems nice so yeah that looks good i like what you did Yeah, I like I like what you did, and it really like because my my thinking when I was thinking it is that it would be functional, and you weren't going for functionality. Like it's still technically functional, but you made it look functional without it didn't be completely functional, which I like. Okay. Yeah, but that that looks really really good. Goodbye, uh, Dragonheart defeat. Um, but yeah, this looks really nice. Oh, and there's a spider crawling up the Among Us man. Oh yeah, no problem. So, yeah, if you want to come back another time, be my guest. Um, anyways, going back to the British story, we were learning about fancy dining, and one of the questions were like, where do the forks go and where do the spins go and where do you, how do you eat like which spoon and fork were you how you know how are they laid out by forks because there's like different forks you need for different meals and i remembered a movie i've seen this movie is one of my favorite movies it's called the kingsman very good movie love the cinema cinematography of it cinematography is the movement of where the camera is during the filming process I'm only saying that because every time I say cinema photography and how much I like it in that movie, people don't understand what I mean by that. But yeah, amazing movie. And there's a scene in the movie where the main character, he's kind of, he's going to have this date with this, she's like the princess of Sweden, I think, in the movie. And with the king of Sweden. But he, he kind of like grew up, you know, not the wealthiest man in the world, you know, didn't have a lot of money. So we never like had to learn how to eat healthy, not eat healthy, eat fancy. And so he had his gentleman friend come and help him. And so I literally used that scene of the movie where the gentleman friend is helping the main character learn. I, that, I literally, anytime we got like 10 out of the 60 questions in the test were about I used just by thinking back to the movie. So moral of the story is if you want to pass the test, just watch The Kingsman. Or just watch it in general because it's a good series. You should listen to Everywhere at the End. You should listen to Everywhere at the End of Time. Is that a podcast or is that a... For a live stream? I'll see if I can do that. So I've been thinking for a while of doing a live stream on my computer, but doing a live stream on OBS kind of scares me. I don't know why. Probably because it took me forever to film a video in OBS. The video I'm editing right now took me forever just to like get the audio and the filming proper on it. It's an album. Okay. It's an album on YouTube. Uh, yeah, I checked that out. I'd probably send one of my friends to go watch, and I'd be like, hey, you think I should do a stream on this? But yeah, I'll, I'll put consideration on it. Actually, so I don't forget, put that in video ideas. I learned this from watching a podcast that had Mr. Beast in it. Uh, he has a document of, a, like, thousands of YouTube ideas. So I just have a Google Doc with a bunch of ideas in it as well. So, okay, 
what is that? Uh, you should listen to everywhere at the same, everywhere at the end of time. At the end of time. Okay. Yeah. So I have a bunch of videos, like a document, and I have it listed of what channels you go on. Because it would get really confusing, because I have a, a lot of ideas. But some ideas require two people. So if it requires two people, then I'm going to get Caden, and we're going to do that. Because uh, that will go on the JK production. But if it only requires one, I'll put it on the J production. If it requires three, it will probably go on the JK production. Just because how I see things with the channel, I don't know if how the other two, Aiden and Caden, see it this way. But I see it as JK Productions kind of has become the center of the channel, even though it has the least amount of videos on it. That's kind of the center of the channels, and then J Productions, this channel is almost a branch off of that, even though this is actually has the most videos, and it's the most consistent when it comes to uploading videos, and also has been here the longest. But, you know, this is a branch off of JK Productions, because it's JK Productions, then just J Productions. Then there's Seafrost, which, It can be seen in two ways. Some people can see it as like its own thing. So you have JK Productions and J Productions, and then its own, th and then Seafrost being its own thing. But I, some people can also see it as it's a, its own kind of branch off from JK Productions. Just kind of depends on how you see it. Because I've seen it in both ways before. Sometimes, right now I kind of see it as its own individual things. Sometimes I'll see it as its own branch off. Jeez, we've been streaming for an hour and a half now. I did not realize how much time that went by. <sighs> trying to think of things I can talk about right now where there's nothing that's coming to mind. Also, my throat's starting to hurt because, as I was saying earlier, in the actually, I don't think anyone is there. There's one person watching. I'll tell the story again because there's more people watching now. Talk about the Spanish story, which Aiden wasn't there either. Aiden, like, left the second I started talking about it and came back, the, like, the absolute second I was done talking about it. But today in Spanish class, our teacher was having us do this weird volleyball thing where they, one team would get a chance to serve. But in order to serve, you got to answer a question. Obviously, the question was about Spanish. So it would be something like, Como se dice, which means, how do you say, um, and then you'll say, like, a word. So, como se dice city block in Espanol, and you have to s say city block in Espanol. The class was separated into two groups, I don't know if I said that. Well, I'm in a story. Whoa. Um... Sorry, Aiden distracted me. I haven't talked for the last 30 minutes, alright? Whose fault is that? Anyways. And then that, if you got it correct, you got the serve, then it was basically like volleyball. But I, n me, the absolute genius that I am, was like, you know what? Because one of the strategies is if someone didn't do the vocabulary, which we had to do on Monday... The other group could ask them, huh? Should, go, sorry, I thought I saw something in chat. Um, the other people in your group could tell you the answer. So it was pretty much just like, you know, answering. Like, it wasn't much of a challenge, because even if you didn't know the answer, you know, there was one person on your group that would be like, who would have the answers, like, at least. So I, being the absolute genius that I am, was like, you know what? 
If I see someone who doesn't have the papers written down and needs to wait for the group, I'm going to yell random Spanish words at them. Because it confuses them. Top tier. Th that right there is the outs most outsmarting play of the year. That is what made us one. Because we were losing. Not going to lie, my team was losing. We were smart, but not athletic. So we were getting answers correct left and right. Like, we were a really smart group. But then, you know, we'd serve the ball twice. And it'd be bad. And so we'd, we would lose a point. So I was mad because I'm competitive. So I was like... So I went in and I disrupted the other team. There, so the teacher would be like, how do you say traffic light? And I'm like, calculator, 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 it's calculator. And oh my gosh, it works way better than I thought it was going to be. Like, of course, some people were able to, like, not listen to me, but there were some people that were, like, would mess up because I was saying words that were already in Spanish. So you're already, like, mentally hearing Spanish, but then you're also hearing fake Spanish at you. And it can get... The words can get messed in someone's head, and they could say the wrong thing out loud. Because you only have 10 seconds to answer each question. Forgot to say that earlier. And so many people got confused, and there was some people that didn't even answer because they they couldn't hear the answer because I was yelling. Oh my gosh! If it wasn't for me, that our our team would have absolutely lost because we were down like five points. So we were like we weren't doing good. And then I came in with my genius strategy, and we won. Anyways, I'm going to see what... Oh my goodness, it's getting bigger. That is huge. What are you building? You were over here this whole time. Dude, what, where's over here? Where have you been? I've been looking around for you. Let's I'm at the bed. thing you're building. Is this, this like a coliseum? No, I was just building the road. Yeah, this looks nice. This, this looks either like a prison, a palace, or a stadium. What is this? Uh, I don't know if I want to tell you yet. Okay. Can't roll it. I'm gonna build a escuela. I mean, school to you non Spanish speakers. And one of the things, like, it's one of those ideas where, like, it keep popping into my head. Then I'm like, that's a good idea. And then I'm like, wait, no, I thought of this before and didn't do it. I've always wanted, to, not always, but for a while, I've wanted to do a stream where I only speak Spanish. I was like, oh my gosh, that would be a cool idea. I could learn Spanish and get views on YouTube. Amazing. Then, you know, I'd think for about it. Because, you know, when you're thinking of ideas on YouTube, you're just thinking of things that sound cool. And you you hear, so you're just thinking of random things and that might sound cool. Then you find something that sounds cool and maybe possibly you're like, oh yeah, that'd be good. But then you actually think about that idea. You're like, hang on. I don't know Spanish. <laughs> I've been taking Spanish for three years. And yet I've talked to someone who fluently speaks Spanish. And I have no clue what they're saying. <laughs> so how am I? Like, I I need to, like, piece together, s like, so much. It is a thought process just to get a sentence that I, like, am not a familiar with. It's just, it's, if I'm not familiar with the sentence, it's just such a hassle. So I'm like, how am I going to do a stream of this? And it, you'd be surprised the amount of times I've thought of that as well. I've thought of, oh, I should just do this for a stream. Then realizing, wait, I've thought of this before and I can't. I'm I'm not gonna lie, I could probably say all the words I know in Spanish and put it in within like three to five minute long video at most. Like probably okay, like a two I minute just, video. I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'll, give, I'll give you a, a 
hint on what the true scale of the building is. So what I'm building right now is a foundation. Oh, that's just the foundation. Okay. What is it gonna do? Escuela, that's right. Okay, I don't wanna build that. I'm gonna build it here because the school bus is already coming. It's going this way. So I'm gonna build it here. Okay, so what kind of what what should I put in the school? What kind of school first? So we're gonna do elementary school. Not that big. Don't have to get creative with the classrooms because elementary school doesn't have like specific classrooms. At least not as it is in the bigger schools. Could do middle school, but honestly, do we want a middle school? No, we don't. Sorry to all the middle schoolers out there. But middle school is just kind of that like other school like that's there. Like you go through it. Like you're only there for three years. Don't spend a lot of time there. Like, it's just kind of gone. You're, like, not, like, you don't have the elementary youth. But you don't have that, like, high school stupidness with responsibility. You're just in middle school. Then you have high school. Which, I already described high school. It's basically getting responsibility. But you're still dumb. <laughs> Just make a combination between middle school and elementary school. Uh, like in one building. Okay. Yeah, I hear what you what you're saying. What I like about schools is schools don't have one entrance. That all the schools I've been to have had multiple entrances, so I don't have to really think too much of where I'm putting the entrance. Because I could put this here, but that doesn't have to be the main entrance. Put another entrance all the way over here. I could put another entrance all the way over here. So I think I'm going to do... I'm going to get foundations down first, though. Get a rough layout. Aha. I'm evolving. This is going to be, I'm going to make this a big school. How big? Quite big. Because that's just how far it's going. That's, ooh, actually. Saw that mansion. We're going to have to make it not as big as I would like it to be. B. Schools are big. Schools are big. Uh, some schools are big. Not all schools are big. You're in a you're you're in a big school. My school is like a third of the size of your school. You know what, I'm going to make, should I make it two stories? I'll make it two stories, because if this is a big city like I want it to be, then Let's it's going to, if it's going to be a big city like I want it to be, big cities need big schools, because big cities have lots of people. Lots of people means lots of families. Lots of family means lots of children. Lots of children means lots of education. I'm building Escuela. Well, with two of us, we could probably have done it like three minutes. But I'm building Escuela. But uh, I think how much spend this much time on this building. Alright, I'll put it this way. I've built this before. So you'll build it again? Yeah. Are you saying hi right now? 
think that's what you're trying to say. I went too far. There's a trident in the ground. How did that get there? I'm gonna sneeze. I'm not gonna sneeze. Okay. Do you have Madden? I used to. I don't have any more. But I, 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 I really like Madden. Madden. I don't know. Me and Madden. It's a love-hate relationship there. I love that game, but I also absolutely hate it. Newer Madden's kind of bad, but that that's where some of the hate relationship is. Like, I really like it because I personally really like football. So I like Madden in that aspect. But also, like, seeing how much of a money grab that game is. I haven't, I haven't played, I think the oldest Madden I've played was 10. It's Madden 10. So I haven't played too much older Madden. But Madden 10. Remember I played, what was my, my first Madden game was 10. Was Madden 10, but I didn't play that too much because I was really young and I wasn't into football. Because, you know, when I was younger, it was kind of like that complicated sport. And as I got older, I was like, it's, it's actually kind of nice. So, but by that time, I didn't, I don't think I was in my possession of my PS3 at that time. And I'd gone to my brother and I got a PS4. And, which is funny because I've never played a Madden game on a PlayStation 4. Beatbox. I'll finish my Madden story, but I'll beatbox after that, I promise. Um, but then the first Madden game I really got into was Madden 17. Which had some cool parts to it. And then I really got into Madden 20. Madden 20, I l loved like, I played so many hours on that game. But I ended up stopped playing because, like I said, me and Madden, we have a love-hate relationship. And well, partially because I know, like, how old other Maddens are and how much better they are. But also, Madden 20 was pretty good. But also, I just got really angered by that game. <laughs> There was actually a problem. So I ended up getting rid of it. I, how much it made me mad and led to it being uh, out of possession. The, pretty much the only way I'll phrase that. And then I haven't played Madden since. Except Madden Mobile, but you know, that's... That is just because I have nothing else to do. Um, you want to hear me beatbox? I'll try. Uh, yeah. <sighs> there you go. 20 out of 10? Thank you. Thank you. I appreciate it. So that'll be its own class. Okay, so. But that could be the stairwell. That could very well be the stairwell.
So this is going to be the cafeteria. There you go. This is, I think that'll just make that a classroom. I think I'll put the stairs. Of course, we're going to have more than one stairs. Oh. Uh. I'm just going to put this here to signify that it's stairs. Well, of course, it's not going to be made out of bricks. It's not going to look like that either. I'm just doing that to signify. Yes. Yes! Where I want things to be. I have built different. Make sure that's a... Look, I know schools. I've been to two high schools, and I can say with confidence that high schools don't like their stairs being thick. Okay? They like small, condensed stairs. Okay? Which is annoying, because if you're right next to the staircase, when the next period starts, and everyone's leaving their class at the same time, and you're stuck in this small, tiny little staircase with a bunch of people going down and then a bunch of people waiting to go up it is just claustrophobic oh, so that's a little um, yeah I will expand that back yeah, that's better now we're gonna make the different classrooms I think I'm going to extend this out here. This will be like the art class, or maybe a computer lab. No, because I don't know how to make the computers in Minecraft. So this will be like the art. Hang on, let me try pronouncing this. Uh, Abamanagus. Abamanagus. Here you go. Abamanagus. Okay. We could split this into two classrooms. Just have to make sure it's even. One. I'm going to do this the slow way because I don't want it to be uh, anti symmetrical. And you should really score. Two. Three. Three. Four. Four. Yeah, Janelle, if you're interested in doing that thing that I talked to you about, you're going to have to get this score. Alright, you didn't really explain too much about it. Yeah, I'll have to do a run through. Mm -hmm. I just did a run through with uh, Brian. Eight, nine, nine, nine. Yes, Brian. Okay, so it's. So one side, it's either going to be uneven, or we're going to have to make it double. And I'm going to make it double. I don't like it being uneven. It'll look weird at first, but as we put the second floor in and more walls around it, it should fit in. And only the people who see this beginning process will be like, oh, that's a double wall, and it looked it, it looked weird at one point. Or that might just be me, because that's how I see things. things is about being like a very small creator it's a lot of the things that I want to do on the channel on my channel require like 
I don't know, because there's some ideas I want to say, but some of them are, like, really good, great ideas, and I want to keep it a secret. But a lot of the things I want to do, like, there's one idea. The most I'll give is the recent video I've been talking about that's going to be really good that I'm working on right now. It has something to do with that. That's the most I'll say. But it has something to do with that, but it will require, like, people... But not this video, but a video I have planned. And I have to hold it off, and I don't know how long I have to hold it off. Because I need fans in order to do it. And, you know, a guy who has 72 subscribers, you know, doesn't have a lot of fans. <sighs> okay. Oh, hello, pal. I'm gonna split this in half. Not fully in half, but... Obviously, the art side's gonna be bigger. And... Heartbreaks. Already getting And heartbreaks? What's that? Actually, I'm going to extend this out one because you have to realize that it's pretty much be like this because there's going to be stairs here. So this is the amount of... Eh, it'll be fine. Uh, back there. And, and heartbreaks back there, Benjamin. And, oh, and I'm confused. Sometimes when people comment, I have problems differentiating to like speaking or if they're speaking, if they're like actually trying to say something or if they're just trying to mess with me. So I won't believe it sometimes. Or sometimes I, I don't understand it and then I'll be like, am I dumb? <laughs> like, am I being dumb or is this person messing with me? the entire interior won't be bricks I'm gonna change it I'm just using bricks right now as the um just to lay everything out just so I can get an idea of where things are gonna be which will be tedious to, like break everything and you know a smart man would you know use the blocks they're gonna use at that moment and then maybe switch some things out throughout instead of you know needing to change your entire build because you decided to make it all out of one block, but you know what? I am lazy. Burning despair does ache. Get what you mean, and I don't get what you mean. That makes sense. Who's typing it? Comma. I'm not joking. Their name is actually just comma. C O M A or just a comma? Just a comma. I'm pretty sure comma spelled spelled with two M's, but you know, if it's not, let me be the. the let me be dyslexic. 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 There you go. Dyslexic. Yeah, that. Okay. I gotta make the hallways, which I don't want to do, but I'm gonna do it.
You good there, bud? I thought so. I thought, I see, I like to take people seriously just in case they're being serious. But sometimes they do stuff to mess with me and I'm like... Um... <laughs> this, uh, uh... Yo hablo inglés. Uh, yo no hablo español. place that this is gonna be a small classroom the losing battle is raging okay going to go with the random stuff now that it has been confirmed Sometimes I like to say random stuff as well. Sometimes I just let autocorrect type a random message to a random person. I don't know if I've done that to Aiden before. Have I done that to you before, Aiden? Uh, just sent you an ab absolutely random message that, absolute, that makes absolutely no sense at all. All right, I'm gonna send one to you. Oh, she ain't coming to that. Uh -huh. uh, uh, comma, pick a. Ra I, I'm gonna pick comma. Ha ha. So I'm just letting autocorrect, autocorrect an entire sentence for me. Okay, autocorrect sentence that I'm sending to Aiden. <laughs> I sent it. Oh, it's much more than I thought. So I started it with comma due to and last moments of peer recall. Okay. I started it with comma due to comma being the commenter. Ha, huh, wordplay. Comma. I'm not going on this week. I have GF. But I'm going on the way home to work, and I can play now if I need anything from me, and make it is a better strategy, my love. I will see if you have few time for me, a few days in a few days, and then I will see if you want me a picture. Madden says he is a good. Madden says he is a good man. Is king king earth. Earth, Moon, Earth, Moon, Sun, President. Drafting them is fine. <laughs> okay. So I gotta plan this out. This, uh, this, um, what's this called? It's a school, that's what it's called. Okay. With what? Placing down uh, a few blocks. A few blocks? Well, technically rails, but... I'm... Bar but, but, but building a escuela. Where are the children supposed to learn, Aiden? They're perpetually stuck on a bus with nowhere to go. I need to give them a home. 
place to go. Making cavern out the city. Where are you getting these from? I'm curious at this point. Where are you getting these random quotes from? Oh, you're full gold. Oh, no, you're not. <laughs> this guy's walking around with full gold, but guess what? You ain't got no shoes. Misplaced in time. <laughs> yeah, usually I use my misplacing as a way to make things look weird. Long decline is over. Okay, what now? You can maximize space and add a classroom here. Haha. -ha. I'm a genius. look absolutely terrible it's always good internal bewildered world Are you reading like the Minecraft subtext? Is that what you're doing? You reading those like weird Minecraft pop-up things? The like when you first open the game? They're not even... Are they popping off? They're not popping off. They're just making noise. Stoop. I'll allow it. I might have an... A I might have a headache, but... You know what? Explosions are cool. Play. 
Excuse me, sir. What are you doing? Think you're Technoblade, eh? Aiming your rocket boat at everyone? You don't got my shot, eh? And we're in creative, so it does nothing. Don't know why I decided to say that phrase in an English accent, but you know what? A bit delay. A little bit delay. Yeah, there's a little bit delay in the stream. Oh, stop. No. Okay, now you're just trying to lag the game. You know, if the, if the game crashes, the stream ends. Which actually, we've been streaming for a bit now. I can finish more of the school later. The school later. My brain's not working. I think this is a good time. We've been streaming for two hours and ten minutes. It's five viewers at one point. Maybe more, because I wasn't paying attention. The auto manual equal no. You're at the point where what you're saying is too complicated for my brain to comprehend. But anyways, I think any well, Rando says there's one person watching, so thank you for watching. Uh, comma, if this is your first stream, welcome to the channel. This is a channel that's been up for six years now, so there's six years of embarrassing videos of me to watch. But uh, anyways, thank. Uh, everyone for watching if you're watching this in the future and you're watching back the stream thanks for watching if you previously watched the stream no you can't hear this right now because you're not watching right now thank you if you're watching it right now thank you is really was nice just a burning memory uh, but anyways thank you all for watching I'll hopefully see you next time in the next sorry I'm prolaging this prolonging this but anyways we'll see you in the next j production goodbye